Hey guys, I'm Nagadepchen, and welcome to my reaction for Fairy Tale episode 88. Well, I'm excited <laughs> because this should be episode where Lucy fights, or they were baiting me <laughs> like real hard. But I hope this will be episode of Lucy fighting, and I want conclusions to all the other fights, I'd like to see them, especially Erza Erza. Like, please give it to me, come on. That's like one of the craziest fights, probably. But like, for real. Also, I do really like this Adela's arc. Like, a really lot. It might be my second most favorite, or even first most favorite arc. It depends. There's still quite some episodes left. So it depends. But so far, my most favorite arc is Battle of Fairy Tail. But this one is really good too. I mean, like, most of these episodes, if I'm correct, I've given like 8 out of 10, which is a lot. So, yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> like, maybe it's because I like um, a lot of characters grow up on me that I'm enjoying Fairy Tale more and more. Yeah, because... At the start, like, it wasn't bad, but I wasn't that much salt yet. I feel like if I would go back to the first episodes, I would definitely like them more than I liked them <laughs> previously when I watched it for the first time. I'm sure of it. Like, that happened to me with One Piece. I really didn't like the starting episodes much. But through the whole anime, I started to like characters more. And even the characters I didn't like that much, like Luffy or Nami, I really appreciate them a lot. Like, you know, later episodes, because of what they went through, how they acted, how they solved things, etc. More than in manga, actually, though, because anime is handling things the way I don't really like it, especially post time skip. And uh, now, like, when I watch like these starting episodes like uh, before they went to Grand Line like I see things in a new different light I actually like these episodes a lot they're starting episodes maybe because they're extremely nostalgic to me or maybe because I see things differently than I saw them before because I didn't like Luffy or Nami and they're very important, like, in the starting episodes. But now I appreciate these characters, so... I think, like, the starting episodes before Grand Line, I like a lot of arcs there. A lot of, actually. <laughs> like, it has such a nostalgic feeling, so I feel like Fairytale probably will be the same. Yeah. <laughs> I do really feel like it. So, I should probably start. And what the hell is this? <laughs> oh, come. Oh my god, he... it's him. Oh. Why are you here, though? What the hell? What, what was this? What the hell? Why he was showing us all this opening? I'm not watching, but... I do really like the song. Oh, because he's going to recapitulate the things. Okay. I mean, weren't you killed? Oh no, they were turned into lacrima. Difference, difference. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Huge get a crystal. Man, that's a plan. I, I mean, I, I I don't think you can do anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do we want to? Especially because how some exceeds are doing their things. Yeah. Um. Yeah, e extermination. Okay. <laughs> I like this journalist, Gajil. He's really cool. Okay.
okay. Oh, okay. Oh yeah, this. Almost forgot. This dude. <laughs> Give me the key. Yeah, the pose. Oh my god. <laughs> she looks kick ass. Throwing fighting pose like this. The great river of what? Stars of pride? Yep. Duh! Well, they're fighting with Grey and Natsu. Yeah, poor girl. Misunderstandings. He means the different. He. I mean, okay then. He means the different one, but okay. She can that is okay. We are going back to this. <laughs> Poor happy. He needs to deal with this. <laughs> I mean, I forgot Gajil is this kind of type of guy. He enjoys it. <gasps> Poor happy. Mm, way to see is a good approach. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, he is a little bit rougher. But, 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 but okay, Gajil. Chill, man. He is. I mean, it's still the Gajil we know. Even though he is in Fairy Tale now. He is a little bit rougher than that, too. Not much, though. <laughs> Because Natsu is destroying a lot of shit around him, too. Yep. And they are probably surprised she can use magic, eh? I, I mean, she looks good at it, but we don't have a time for appreciation. <gasps> oh yeah, they are surprised. I mean, not seems like he is. Jesus, what this dude can do about this, though? Oh, yeah, that must be so confused. <laughs> How is she doing that? How this works? What the hell is this? Okay, he's using some kind of li li yeah, liquid. Damn. It burns, apparently. Or flame out. And now he's doing something different. Okay, that's actually interesting. It's like potion, but it actually casts magic. That's interesting. Oh, Virgo. Ah, the queen. <laughs> oh my god, dude. This dude is getting wrecked. Maybe Sia? <laughs> no, even though she's rich. This girl must be so conflicted. Yeah. She must be so conflicted. Virgo, <laughs> what the hell are you thinking here? Come on, <laughs> that would be quite extreme. Okay, the dude is not done. Uh... Well, I've seen a lot of weird things, but no shit, Sherlock. <laughs> oh, okay, he turned himself into Octopus. Okay. I mean, oct uh, uh, octopuses? 
octopi are pretty cool animals, but um, not like this. No, I don't approve. Jesus Christ, he's big. Okay, you're getting a little bit far. You think she would... Riga, come on. <laughs> come on, Riga. Oh, okay. Good question. Oh. But, uh, thanks, I guess. Why though? <laughs> yeah, Riga, come on, be a little bit nicer. <laughs> Even though she she is sassy. Now Lucy's getting weapons, that's actually kinda cool. She is good with a whip. So this should be kinda similar oh ish. This looks interesting. I'm not sure. I've never seen this, so I don't know how this works. What the hell is it? What does it do? What what kind of magic is it? I don't know, it must... It, it, it probably did something? Oh, shut up. We didn't expect you to turn into a huge octopus. Thing. Freaky. You are freaky. Oh, she's thinking about something like this. Mm. Yeah, it's mutual. She's nice to them. They're helping her. Okay, she's thinking about... Oh, yeah, it's like a whip. But it's some kind of weird, magical, whatever the thing. <laughs> okay, Lucy's using her brain. Well, maybe... I mean, now you're attacking her, so she has something to do with it and... Okay, creep. I have to scan up with him, though. Yeah, he is creep. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> this girl's like, what did she just say? Aw. Yeah, we don't go by this kind of rules like you guys. We actually care about our people. Oh, the music. Cool. This web looks hella amazing. <laughs> well, now he's burning. Oh. oh. Natsu came into the picture. <laughs> I mean, they are kind of freaky. Not gonna lie. It was cool as she was just like flying around with the web. <laughs> Can you imagine Lucy at the start doing that? I can't. <laughs> wow. She's getting better at things. Probably because she gained some huge confidence, even though she always was kind of bossy. Cool, right? Um, <laughs> this is octopus dude. Now explain. Is the octopus dude done though? Her girl. She's just been hurt her legs and then squeezed. Come on. Yeah, and she still let him run away. Because she cares about Lily Punter and how is his name? Hmm. That's girl. Poor girl. Can you break it though?
Oh, this man. Of course. Of course. You won't let them. Got them. Oh, oh, okay. Where did you get that? I mean, we know he's good with motorbikes. <laughs> Okay. Of course he's going to be persistent. I would be too because just burn you down. Okay. Be careful. Be careful guys. It, well, they don't know I guess. They don't know about his abilities. Will it still work? What the? Oh my god, they're sinking deep. Oh. Well, I wouldn't like to be in their position and the uh, lights are getting out. It's kind of hard to manipulate your way around when it's dark. Okay, that's new transition. Fairy tale transition. That fairy tales, whatever. I don't know. Oh. Oh, okay then. Important key. What are you telling him though? <laughs> oh, oh, the rest is secret. You shouldn't tell him. Yeah, everyone would figure it out. It's something important. Dumbass. Villain. Ah, oh, the music is so cool. Good damn Grey, why are you looking so hot? <laughs> no, he's too young! Oh, that's cool. Well, maybe he has a plan. I mean, yeah, it's still the ice. <laughs> Eat that wall. Jesus Christ, Gray. He just throw that at him. But it's pro yeah, it seems like it's a part of his plan. Jesus Christ. Finally some Gray fight. Using his brain, I like it a lot. I like it a lot when people use their brains. But, uh, what, what now, though? Yeah, I, I was thinking that, like, would you be able to bre break it? No. Well, we need to destroy it. So annoyed. Can you please stop it? That's true. I mean, okay then. You can just freeze things. Maybe he is kind of. I mean, yeah, you would need to kind of flex it back, and that would be kind of problematic. I mean, yeah, that's a way how to use this for too. Be careful, Gray. Think of something. Ooh, more freezing. Be careful with that death stuff. <laughs> oh my god, they are persistent, persistent both of them. Someone will get tired for sure sooner or later. Come on, Grey, just 
freeze the freak. <laughs> Come on, Gray. Freeze him. Freeze him. Come on. Don't let him. <laughs> what is this Dragon Ball episode? Oh. The key is like, I have enough of this crap. <laughs> <laughs> it's probably possible right now because it got cracked. Yes, just freeze, freeze, freeze until he give up. Well, he doesn't need it, you need it. Oh my god. Are we sure about that, though? Are we sure about it? Probably, maybe. Oh, okay. It's very powerful. But we have Natsu and Gajil and Wendy. They might be able to destroy even that huge. Even that huge. Yeah. They're strong. Come on, Gray. Don't let him to. I'm sure Natsu, Wendy, and Gadgil will be able to do that. That will utilize all their strength to destroy it. Gray, don't listen to him. Come on, Gray. Come on, Gray. Shut it, man. Ray, don't listen to him. No! Believe in your friends. Believe in your friends. It's cracking. Come on. This dude is trying everything he has. For real. Don't believe him. Just smack him or freeze him or just crack it indefinitely. Thank you, Ray. We believe in our people. We don't care about you. <laughs> this dude is like, um, the plan backfired. <laughs> oh, shut up. <laughs> Smooth undressing. Yeah. Now he's like, fuck you, I don't care. Damn. I'm sure this looked way better in manga. <laughs> Damn. Well, he deserved that. Everyone in Fairy Tail is nuts. But it's dangerous to have it. We believe in our people, so shut up. Oh, he can... Uh -uh. <laughs> of course, he can make objects. So maybe when it was in the ice, he kind of memorized how it is, I guess. <laughs> well, he got you fooled, idiot. Okay, this is just the next episode. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. <laughs> 
Oh my god, Gray, he went kinda hot for a second there. Okay, so I'm going to give this episode 7.5 out of a 10. We had Lucy's fight, even though it was kinda not to finishing, finishing that dude off because he became a huge octopus. Oh my god. Kinda fit his personality though because he was really creepy. Yeah. Uh, what a creep. So, but, like, that that was cool weapon. Like, well, weapon. It was more of a weird, magical, like, thing. Kind of like a whip. But it looked really cool. I really like how it looked. Yeah. So she was able to, like, swing around. That gives her like a lot of um, movability, so that's like really cool. Yeah, she can move around very quickly, get to places with it. So th that's really that's really interesting. And now to finish them off, plus uh, his his opponent, so they went down. But because that dude, what is his name, Sugar Boy? Uh, he was running away from Gray, and he al also stole their key. The key. He stole the key from them, or took it back, because it was stolen from them. Oh, whatever. So he took it back. Uh, Gray was going after him on a motorbike, which I get he got from the amusement park. But he's good at it. I really. Uh, I still remember that freaking amazing fight he had with Racer. That was such a cool fight <laughs> with Leon. That was it was so cool. Oh my, I really love that one. So he was following him, and Sugar Boy kind of made the floor kind of weirdly melty, whatever. So Lucy and Natsu got trapped in it with the octopus, and the lights went out. So. Yeah, it wouldn't be easy to escape. I wonder what happened to them. But Gray followed his opponent and was trying to freeze him with a key and destroy it. So they were kind of fighting. There were like some really cool moves from Gray again. I just wish that his fights would be as cool as Natsu's because he doesn't find that often. And like. There are not that much memorable fights, race fights, which is kind of sad. Yeah, but there were like really some really cool movements, moves, movements, moves, both, I guess. Though it was a little bit stretched out, the animation. <sighs> I get it, I get it, I'm sure it looked way better in manga. I get it. Makes me a little bit sad because I was really excited for a great fight. <laughs> but he was clever. Uh, he was prepared to freeze him and destroy the key. So the key was kind of hard to destroy, but because uh, Sugar Boy was kind of chopping off the eyes and getting it out, and Gray was freezing it again and again, it kind of started to give up. And. Yeah, then he destroyed a key, even though Sugar Boy was kind of trying to... I mean, he said he was telling the truth, but he was definitely trying to fool him. Into, like, not destroying that, because they need it. And, like, he, I'm sure he was thinking of stealing it from Grey again, if he wouldn't destroy it. Or he would have a way how to get it, you know? So I'm glad that uh, Grey destroyed it, but... He is able to like make the key, which kind of makes sense because he can make like stuff from ice, so he can just basically stuff the ice inside of that machine and make a key. Yeah, that kind of makes sense, I guess. And he was holding the key for a while, and he had a look at it, so he was probably able to like copy it. So that's cool. Damn, the sugar boy got baited. <laughs> Kinda ish. Yeah. <laughs> Gray fooled him. That was kinda really cool and clever. I like that. But, like, we have our 
three like dragon slayers. I believe in them. And in worst case scenario, we have the key, I guess. Probably. Uh, Gajil is still fighting the Panther Lily. He seems like very strong opponent. Like, really strong. And like, maybe because he's, he looks very serious, way serious than Sugarbot and Yunus, what's his name? Like, they're kind of fools. <laughs> kind of-ish. But Panther Lily looks hella serious. How strong, uh, like, how strong is he? Because if I look at all these people in the kingdom, like these captains, Pandra Lily and Erza definitely looks like the most scariest. <laughs> yeah, hundred percently. Yeah, so I guess he's very strong. Oh, we're still jumping with the fights, but more fights ended, so that's cool. I want to see the next episode. Yeah. Where does Will go? We need to destroy that huge lacrima. Uh, we need to get back home. <laughs> yeah, and... The, like, Adela's fairy tale, please? What are you doing right now? Right now? Like, can you help us? Maybe a little bit? Tiny little bit? And I don't even know, like... How how hard it would be to get back home. I didn't thought about that. <laughs> Probably wouldn't be easy, right? Hmm. That's interesting. Yeah. So I guess that's all. Goodbye and see you next time.